Anthony, thanks for taking time, and congratulations on a marvelous performance this past week against Gray Collegiate. You are this week's Dreer Providence Heart Boys Play of the Week, and gosh, you threw for a touchdown, you ran for a touchdown, and then you had not only two pick sixes, but they were both 90-plus yards, one of them 101. Have you ever had a game like that before? I did not never have a game like that. It was, it was good. It was just for making plays, man. Coach put me out there. Just making plays. Two touchdowns on each side of the ball. Which more were kind of more fulfilling to you, taking the two pick sixes back or scoring on the offensive end? I know they're all great. Yeah, I, do, I like defense, so I like the two pick sixes. So. Now, when you got the first one, I mean, it's not often that you get to take it to the house on the other end of the field. Now, when you, when you intercepted the second one and it was obvious to you that I'm taking this one back too, yes, what was going through your mind? Like what? Is, like, am I dreaming? <laughs> <laughs> no, I just, I just feel like nobody could catch me. So just, just doing your thing. Yeah, I'm just doing my thing. But did you kind of lay back on both of those picks and kind of jump the route? Uh, I jumped the route. I seen him go outside, shake outside, and then he came back inside. So I jumped the route, caught the pick, took it to the house. Well, that was an amazing game for you, and obviously. The Blue Devils are going to need another one kind of like that coming up on Friday, yes, going sir. to play over at River Bluff and, you know, 5A school, big team, strong team, super well-coached team. What are the Blue Devils going to have to do to be able to come out of there with a win on Friday? Uh, well, I've been watching film on them. So they, they like, they run. They run a lot. They don't pass a lot. So we got to stop the run. Mm -hmm. yes. Good week of practice so far. Yes, sir. Good week of practice. We've been – They've been running a lot of outside, try to get us the, uh, Get you ready? Yeah, get us ready. As far as the prospect of going, and obviously with this 5A being a new classification this year, the biggest in the state, and this would, for obvious reasons, be the first time Dreer's not only first time you have a chance to beat a 5A team because it's the first one you play, is, is everybody kind of a little extra hyped because you do have an opportunity to move up like that and do something that school's never done before? Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, they we trying to trying to win make us the, the first 5 eight play uh school we played yeah i don't know it's just it's real hype i don't know and uh and obviously starting 2-0 and is right where you guys wanted to be but i think making it extra impressive is you have not just won the games you've won them emphatically you guys are doing what you have to do to to uh, i guess the best way to put it is there was no question about either game going into the fourth quarter which is what you want to do so yes, uh is there anything that you guys other than just regular improvement is there anything that really jumps out that you need to do a whole lot better or you guys just need to keep working yeah just keep working keep getting better well, congratulations, because I will tell you, you are the you are as deserving as anyone has been this year as the yes, Providence Heart Dreers boy play, Boys Player of the year, year of the Week. Seems like the year after that <laughs> game you had. And uh, best of luck to you on Friday out there, yes, man. Thank, thank you, Anthony. Thank you.